Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Jasmine. Um, I am transgender. I did start transitioning June 15, 2017. I am pre-op, meaning I still have my package. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys how to tuck for the summer. Um, if you're like me, you love going to the beach, you love wearing bikinis, you love wearing bathing suits, you love being in water. Um, I think this video is really going to help you. And if you're just a cisgender female who wants to know how do we do it, you can also find out in this video how we do it. Um, there's two different ways that I know how to tuck. I'll be showing you guys both ways. One is a little uncomfortable. And then the other one is more comfortable, but I don't feel as secure as the first one. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so the first tuck and penny that we have is from Tuck It Up. It's a website that specializes in transgender tuck and panties. I'll link them below so that you guys can check out their website. Um, so I use this pretty much every day for jeans or dresses. Um, when I do wear leggings, I tend to double it, meaning I wear two of these so that it can be like really compressed. Um, it's basically cotton inside and it's just a regular thick gaff. They're usually called gaps. So I usually don't wear these for the beach because I feel like it makes it look thick down there, like in your private part. It looks a little thick for me in a bathing suit, so that's why I don't really wear these to the beach or like to a pool. But underneath my jeans, underneath my leggings, underneath my dress especially, this is like my go-to tucking panty. Now, I'm going to show you guys the second one. You guys cannot judge. It's a little homemade, and I think it works best for me. So, here's the second one. It's basically this and this. Yeah, it looks crazy. So, first is the top part of a underwear. You cut off the elastic band from, like, any thick underwear that you have. These are honestly from boxers. I cut boxers off of this, and I kept the elastic band. And then this is the tube of a tube dress sock. Like, of a dress sock. You cut the tube out, you throw the foot part out, and you keep the tube. And this is your second tucking panty. And when I tell you, this is like the best tucking panty for the beach, for a bathing suit, for a bodysuit. This is like your number one go-to. Like, this is how it looks when it's on so i'm going to show you guys how to look how the bathing suits look in both tucking panties and the tuck it up one and then the homemade one so you guys can kind of see the difference of how they look and how they feel okay so this is the first tucking panty i'm just showing you guys how this looks in a one-piece bathing suit with an open back And as you can see, for me at least, I feel like it still looks a little bulky. And this is with the tuck it up panty. However, maybe in my mind, it's making me think that way. But you might like how this looks. But in reality, I don't like how this looks. I'm going to show you guys how it looks in the second tuck and panty. And you guys be the judge and let me know what you think. Okay, now this is how it looks in the second homemade tucking panty. I honestly feel like this looks better. Like, I just feel like it's so much tighter. And I feel more comfortable. I mean, it's not as comfortable as the first one, but I feel more comfortable in this mentally because I just feel like it's more secure, it's tighter, like nothing's going to come out. So this is with the second homemade tucking panty. I'm going to show you guys at least one or two more bathing suits so that you guys can see a gif of how they look in different bathing suits in a two-piece and a one-piece. But yeah, so far this is my go-to. Okay, now this is bathing suit number two. This is with the tuck it up tucking panty. And as you can see, it doesn't look terrible. Don't get me wrong, like... I would probably still wear this one out if I needed to, but again, in my mind, I feel like it's not as tight or as compressed as the homemade tucking panty. So this is just how it looks. 
in my mind, like I said, I just feel like it looks a little more bulkier, like, and I want it to be super flat. Alrighty, this is in the second tuck and panty. This is the homemade one. Like I said, I feel so much more better in this one. Mentally, I feel like it's flatter. I feel like it's not noticeable. It's not as thick, in my mind at least. It might look the same to you guys, but I feel like it's so much flatter. I don't know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think. Would you guys go with the tuck it up panty, or would you guys go with the homemade tucking panty? Okay, last but not least, we have this mermaid-like print bathing suit. It's a, also a one-piece. This is with the Tuck It Up panty. Again, in my head, I feel like it's thicker than I would like it to be. It just looks a little more bulkier. But, like, honestly, I would probably still wear this one out if I needed to but I just don't feel as comfortable as I would in my own homemade tucking panty. I also want to mention that if you do wear a bathing suit with prints or like lines I think it distracts from the area more so I think that would be a better bet versus going with a solid print like black one would work best or anything with prints. However, if you're doing like a solid yellow, a solid red, a solid green, I feel like it'll be a little more detectable that you're hiding something. At least in my mind. I don't know about you guys, but that's just what I think. But again, I'm going to show you guys how it looks with my homemade tucking panty. So last but not least, this is how it looks in the homemade tucking panty. Again, in my head, this looks so much better. This fits tighter it's more secure I feel like it looks so much flatter like again it might just be in my head but I would definitely pick the homemade tucking panty versus the bought one from tuck it up only for bathing suit purposes because for jeans and leggings and dresses the tuck it up panty works so much better however for a bathing suit I think this is my go-to and this should be your go-to. Um, so just tell me what you guys think.